Major Delta Development Commission has flagged off the distribution of 45,000 U lesson educational tablets and software initiatives to primary and secondary schools in the Niger Delta region, marking the largest educational technology investment in Africa. The Commission's Managing Director, Dr. Samuel Obuku, represented by the NDDC Director, Education, Health and Social Services, Dr. George Ozonwane highlighted the Commission's dedication to fostering educational initiatives that promote literacy, numeracy, and lifelong learning. If you recall, during COVID, all schools were closed. And um, it was only the children of the rich that had the opportunity of having these university tablets and they continued their education. So the NEDC felt that the children of the Niger Delta also deserve to have these opportunities, these tools, to be able to compete with their contemporaries around the country. Because the people that, who, the people that patronized this in the past were people in the Lagos, Kano, Abuja, Potapet maybe, but not people in our communities. So we felt that we need to deploy these tools to enhance their education. And that was how this program was birthed. NDDC consultant for the U Lesson Group, Mr. Sim Shagaya, emphasized the importance of technology in today's world and praised the NDDC for taking the lead in ensuring Niger Delta youth are not left behind. To be completely honest with you, this device was used by the elite of Nigeria. So a lot of the customers were from, you know, Ikoi and Victoria Island and Leki and Suruleri and Metama and, the, you know, the traditional elite. This is the first instance in which a government agency is standing as a middleman between you lesson and the average person and the masses, so to speak. And by doing that, they're helping me achieve a dream that I've had. Um, something so powerful as a U-Lesson tablet should not only be used by the elite, it should be used by everybody, but only government can serve that go-between, that middleman um, um, purpose. The second thing also is that this is the largest intervention of its kind in education technology. It really took a lot of vision and a lot of boldness on the part of NDC, NDDC to pursue this, and they have to be commended for it. Now, you listen to NDDC Executive Director, Project Sa Victor Ntai, who was represented by the NDDC Director, Utility, Infrastructure Development and Waterways, Engineer Albert Egbe, emphasized the importance of adapting to technological advancements. Also, Paramount Ruler of Onopa, Chief Tamama Morris, commended the Commission for the novel program, noting that it would offer more learning opportunities for students in the Niger Delta region. To each of the school in the area for for advanced learning, it's very encourageable. But I'd like to 